So I know it's, uh, it's a very controversial issue, but I think um, uh, ours should not be as controversial as that of the United States. His Excellency, we are happy to be here today. Thank you. You are most welcome. We, some time ago, last uh, year, we, on Nigeria, and you graciously obliged and wrote the foreword. So we are here today to let you know that that book is ready and also to present it to you as a mark of respect. Uh, not because you wrote the foreword, but because of the position you have occupied in Nigeria. We have not uh, unveiled the book, <coughs> but we felt that it is necessary that we give you the book first to see, and the unveiling of public presentation is holding in Abuja next month on the 20th. September at uh, the Yaradua Center. We also want to use the opportunity to enter the public presentation because we are present as former vice president and a man who has made tremendous impact in the social, economic and, and political development of Nigeria. You know, and uh, why we went into this book, it's actually the second book we are writing on Nigeria. That's the sun, when I say the sun, the, uh, when I say we, I mean the sun. In the year 2010, we wrote the first book on Nigeria, and the title then was The Golden Book, because it was to commemorate the 50th anniversary of Nigeria, and it was well received also. So, 10 years down the line, we were compared to do a sequel to it, to also update and then bring in some other things into the book. And that's what informed this one. The, the title of this one is The Making of Modern Nigeria, from pre-colonial era till date. And it talked about the evolution of Nigeria, development, different sectors, people and institutions that have shaped the country and people including those who have played their part and departed dead and those who are living and the institutions including those that folded up and then those that are present and uh, uh, you know we are doing it to chronicle Nigeria as at a time when our children are not even studying uh, history we felt that a book like this will be a, a compendium and a guide for them to understand Nigeria, to know certain things that happened before them. And also, it will you know, also send a picture that history is important because it is when we know where we are coming from, then why we are here, then it will help to shape the future. So His Excellency, I will, uh, on behalf of the Son of Mission Limited, present this book to you. has been a very of recent uh, topical and also 
uh, what would I say, uh, challenging issue. Because I remember as far back as 2015, when I met then Minister of Education in Oxford University, an event, and I complained to him that uh, the absence of the teaching of history in our schools has left, you know, uh, the current uh, Nigerians uh, ignorant from where we are coming and where we are going. Uh, his reply then was that uh, the government was trying to put together a, a team that will uh, produce an acceptable history of, of, of Nigeria. I don't know what he meant by an acceptable history of Nigeria. But as far as I know, history can be approached from different perspectives. And therefore, it only left for the authorities to determine a standard history book that should be uh, <coughs> you know, taught in, in our schools. Uh, the United States is still battling you know, about teaching history, which history. Uh, some states are saying, no, there is no need to teach about you know, uh, history or black history or civil rights history and, and, and so on and so forth. So I know it's, uh, it's a very controversial issue, but I think um, uh, ours should not be as controversial as that of the United States. Because the United States appears that every state determines its own history in the co context of uh, the United States of, of America. So I want to commend you for embarking this uh, uh, enterprise, and I hope that it will enrich, you know, uh, particularly our students, current students, and even those who are not in school, who apparently, I want to believe that the majority of current Nigerians um, are very, very ignorant, uh, you know, of the history of this country, uh, because one, uh, it has been long we taught history in our schools. Uh, I think it will replace with what they call is it social, uh, social, social civil studies, studies and, and so on and so forth. So I, I think this is a very good attempt, you know, to try and <coughs> uh, fill the vacuum that has been uh, created uh, over the years, particularly since after the Civil War. So I commend you very much indeed for uh, putting so much work into this. And I look forward to, to, to attending the event. Thank you very much.